Now I'm going to show you the most powerful payment justification there is on the planet. Okay? I am told, I am told by salespeople that I've never met in my entire life. I never will meet them. I don't know where they are. I am told by hundreds of salespeople that what I'm about to show you right now is worth 50 grand a year to you. Okay? Over and above what you would make otherwise. And it's not difficult, but you actually have to learn it. I'm not sure I've ever showed it to you, Nathan. Okay? All right, so what you're telling me, Nathan, is you can make the 2388, you just don't want to. I mean, you're being a hard case, but I understand. I get it. Okay? What I'm going to say next is going to sound just a little bit crazy, but it's the absolute truth. You are not going to pay 2388 to drive this truck. Okay? You pay 2388 to own it, but you're not going to pay 2388 to drive it. All right? Look, everybody knows that this truck any truck, any car, is going to depreciate over a, what's the term of the loan here? Uh, 48 months. Over the next four years, it's going to depreciate, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, here's what you don't want to do. And what I'm drawing right now is a check. Okay. The graphics you need to do. And by the way, all the graphics are in the package I just gave you. All right. Turn to page... <clears throat> Last page, page six. I'm just drawing, you know, those are really pretty graphics there. I'm drawing squares and rectangles, all right? What you don't want to do, Nathan, is you don't want to pay 2388. I get it. I understand. You don't want to sign the check. You don't want to make it out to a lender, and you do not want to send it to a lender because you, like most people, think the lender keeps it all, right? Mm-hmm. Look, everyone knows the vehicle's going to depreciate, but what everybody doesn't know is there is a savings element to every single truck payment you make. Not all of this is going away forever. A chunk of it is going to come back to you. Let's figure, has anyone ever showed this to you before? Act like a customer. No. Okay. Let me show you. Look. Um, Pay attention to this, guys. It's important. 48 months from now. You're going to make your 48th payment, okay? Mm -hmm. What comes back to you in the mail a couple of weeks later, Nathan? The title. But it's a really cool title because it's only got one name on it, and that is your name, correct? Mm -hmm. It's called Free and Clear. Now, four years from now, Nathan, you don't have a truck payment anymore. Mm -hmm. You've paid the sucker off. But what do you think this... $77,000 vehicle is going to be worth in four years. If you drive it like you intend on driving it, use it like you intend on using it, but you don't crash it, you don't trash it, what do you think it'll be worth? Forty-five. So, four years from now, you've got a truck, no payment, and a $45,000 piece of paper that really acts like a very expensive share of stock. I mean, you could trade this, couldn't you? You could sell it. You could borrow against it. Okay? Pull that calculator back up. Nathan, divide 45,000. By? 48. $937. Nathan, do you know what that 937 represents? No. The amount of money you're saving with every payment you make. In essence, when you send the 2388 to the lender, metaphorically speaking, $937 is flowing straight back to your title. All right? So, I told you, you'd pay 2388 to own it, but you're not going to pay 20, 2388 to drive it. Because if we subtract 937 from 2388, we got 159 from 23 is what? 14? It's going to cost you $1,400 a month to drive this truck. Now, I need you to okay this right down here so I can get your truck ready for delivery. What's the, yeah, I'm done. Look, I've got, I've got an airplane to catch tomorrow, okay? Okay. Have you ever seen that before? Yeah, I have a question about that. Actually. Yeah. Because I think you've shown it one time. It, what if the person, because like, I just ballparked the 45K, like. Um, if the customer doesn't give you an answer? 
Yeah. Um, I pull up KBB on my phone okay. and go back and find a, a four-year-old 2500 and see what how it depreciated and show it to the customer and use that number. Use, okay. Yeah. Okay. Most customers will give you a number. Okay. And but even if, if you told me 25,000, can I still reduce the net effect of the payment? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What's easier to say yes to? 2388 or 1451? 1451. It's all about making it easier for the customer to say yes. Mm -hmm. All right? Now, um, and basically, you're giving every customer that buys a new or used vehicle from you a price guarantee, too, aren't you? Because what can they do during the first three days or 150 miles? Return it. So it's basically a riskless proposition, right? I work with uh, 